Hi guys, welcome to my doll room. I thought we'd do the unboxing here. I just have a brief break in between classes today. I teach my most, my um, heaviest amount of classes on Saturdays. So I just went to the mailbox on my break. This is really my only time that I have a break on Saturdays in the middle of the day. I have eight classes on Saturdays. <laughs> but anyway, today I'm opening some vintage cabby mail, something I purchased off of eBay. This should be a Sakuda, so I'm pretty excited. I'm a little nervous, always nervous when you <laughs> make an investment in something like a Jesmore or Sakuda and you're hoping it's everything you hope for. I know that this one had an issue of missing a couple of hair loops, but I'm hoping that's not a huge deal. He looked adorable. You guys might have seen him if you follow the auctions on eBay. He was a little blonde passy boy. So let's check him out, guys. Now, Sakuda was made in Japan and they're very coveted with collectors. Jesmar are the ones made in Spain. Sakudas are made in Japan. And the unique thing about Sakudas is that if you look at their eyes, you can see a butterfly pattern. So that looks adorable. This seller made a cute little hand tag for him. How cute is that? Look at this little guy. She made a little hand tag with his name. Hi, my name is Archer. Number four head mold, Sakuda, born 1984. So if you want to take a look at that, isn't that cute? And so I don't know if you guys can see, <laughs> but the thing with Sakudas is you should be able to make out that butterfly pattern in their eyes, which is pretty cool. And look at how cute he is in his little outfit. Just adorable. Let's see if I could sit him there for you. All right, so he's got a couple of things here. I'm thinking his pacifiers in here. Every day is like Christmas lately since I got back into collecting. It's a little insane, guys. <laughs> Aw, she even gave the <laughs> his little slinky that he had in his photo on eBay. <laughs> and also his, his passy, how cute. She put a little paper protector, I guess. Some people keep those in to protect their little mouths, their faces. I maybe should do that as well, but I never do, usually. <laughs> but let's put his passy in. He's a little, his head's a little soft right now. I'm in Arizona and he was in the mailbox locked up in the parcel locker. I had to go rescue him out of there, guys. Look at how cute he is. Gotta get that hand posed in the passy. Look at how cute. Oh, it's so adorable. Little archer. And so on the back of his neck, which is typical for Sakudas, it's a two line, two lines of writing with a J and then a number. So his says J4. And you see that below that the number before below the two lines of writing you see the number four head mold. I don't know if you guys will be able to see that. It's kind of not it's kind of dark in here but I'll try I'll try but pretty excited with him I'm going to move my camera and show you guys this is my Sakuda wedding set which is very coveted with collectors I got that recently and I'm so excited with that so if you take a look at these guys you should be able to see the butterfly patterns with them as well in their eyes so anyway i'm gonna say bye now from archer and i and have a great rest of your day everybody bye bye until next time